I handle the fire department's accelerant detection canine uh, for this side of North Dakota. Webster has the ability to smell for any type of different ignitable liquid. So up to 60 different types of accelerants. That is amazing. Yeah, very, very cool. All right, you want to show us what he can do? Absolutely. You ready to show us, Absolutely. Webster? Absolutely. This is 50% evaporated gasoline. This is Webster's training aid. So what we do with this is we could put it in different places or different hides in wherever we're working. This little tiny amount? That little tiny, it's, it, you could take a toothpick and dip it in the end. It's quite, uh, it's quite amazing. Dog smelling parts per billion. Let's go. Seek, 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 seek. Yeah, he's in it, seek, seek. Yeah, good boy. So what happened at Nikki's and Chad's house? So uh, Webster and I basically did what we just showed you here. And uh, we went into the bedroom. The dog walked in, and as soon as the dog walked in, he gave me what we call a change of behavior. But he alerted to me that there was uh, possibly the presence of an ignitable liquid. Now, they had put a propane heater there, right? They had, yeah. There was a, a propane heater. So there was something beyond just the propane. That's correct. And yep. Webster could Webster tell. found it. Yep. So investigators took that as a sample, sent it to the laboratory, and the laboratory confirmed it as a, a medium distillate um, material. Which is what? Uh, it could have been lighter fluid or gasoline or, you know, I'm not exactly sure what it was. On the bed? On the bed and on the floor. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.